Hi, I'm Shari Love and welcome to this uh, Google Workspace admin tutorial from Apps, Events and Acer. And today what I'm going to do is really just show you how you can track external sharing across Google Workspace. So this is when users choose to share files and folders, uh, share data from Google Drive and to share that data with somebody external to your organization in some way. So that could be that they uh, share the link um, to the file so that anyone with that link can access it. It could be that they share specifically with somebody external to your domain. So a specific individual user or group of users uh, that are external to your organization that they share with, or users can also potentially make files public, meaning that they're publicly available on the web and accessible to all with or without the link. So, um, to do that, to have a, an overview of, of what's being shared externally day by day from your Google Workspace domain, uh, what you need to do is first of all, go and have a look at your reports. So here I am in the admin console. And what I'm going to do is just go down to reporting. And I'm going to look at my highlights. So this is available in all the editions of Google Workspace. And if I drop down to my highlights, what I will get here is how are files shared externally. So this shows me over time, just over the last six months or so, it shows me how users have been sharing data. So we have a, a peak here, for example, where files have been shared outside of the domain. So they've been shared with other users outside of our domain. You'll see that the, the red, uh, track here is anyone with the link. So we have a little spike here of anyone with the link and we have some public sharing going on as, as well with a little spike here more recently. Now this information, you can choose to view the details. So when you click on view details of that, you'll get the drive report specifically, which is the same report at the top. And then it has some more details down below about internal sharing and when files were added and active users. Um, you can export this data for further analysis. So just by clicking download, you'll get a Google Sheet uh, or a CSV file with, with the download of that data for additional analysis if you wish. That looks a little bit like this. So this is what you get. You get the total number of public shares, anyone with the link and outside the domain for each day in the range that you've got there. So you can see, you know, any particular spikes in sharing within the domain. <clears throat> now, to take a further look at that across all editions of Google Workspace, the next thing you want to do is have a look at the audit reports and what's possible there to see. So if I go into my, uh, if I go into my audit reports now, go to reporting, I'm going to collapse that menu, open up audit, and I'm going to go to Drive. Now here within Drive, I see all the activity within Google Drive, uh, what users have done, what, how they've shared files, how they've, uh, when they've accessed files and such. And if I go to my filter, I'm interested in, in sharing. So where the sharing permissions have changed and users have potentially shared used information externally. So I'm going to look for visibility and I'm going to look for files that are shared externally and I'm going to apply that in my audit log. So this will show me within the audit log where files have been shared externally and activity on those external files. So you'll see the visibility shown as shared externally and these files are either being edited um, or they could have had their permissions changed to be externally externally visible as well. So these files are being edited. Let's go back and have another look here. Maybe I was interested in when the visibility changed. So they, they changed from internal to external. So files that have been changed from being shared internally in the organization to being external. And here I see the activity around files being changed to be externally visible. And again, just as before, you can download that information so for further analysis. You can click on download here. And, and when you do that, 
uh, you will also get a Google Sheet. And the Google Sheet looks a little bit like this, where you have title, the event description, someone edited an item, uh, you get information about who the user was and what the visibility of the file was. So you can download that activity around audit and Google Drive logs to see who was doing what when, particularly useful when you want to have a look at who has externally shared files and what is happening with those files. So that's really just a quick look through how you can very quickly, with any addition to Google Workspace, view what's happening with Google Drive external sharing, see what's happening with your users, and get further information downloaded so you can take action as appropriate. Thank you for watching. I'm Charlie Love, and this has been a Google Workspace admin tutorial from Apps Events and Acer. Mm -hmm.